Yehovah Svaot Elohim. Kadosh, Kadosh, Kadosh. Please fill me and lead me and cover me and stir me and speak through me with your rule Kodesh, that I may speak your written words with boldness and humility to those who listen. I ask all these things in Yeshua HaMashiach's name. Amen. We'll start with the Shema. Listen and obey. Children of Yehovah, pay careful attention and respond. Yehovah is our power and authority. Yehovah works in unity with himself. And you shall act upon your love to Yehovah with your power and authority, with your thoughts and mind, with your entire body, and with all the muchness that you have. Yod, hey, vav, hey. Hand, behold, nail, behold. Psalm chapter 15. A Psalm of David. Yehovah. Who can rest in your tent? Who can live on your holy mountain? Those who live a blameless life, who behave uprightly, who speak truth from their hearts and keep their tongues from slander, who never do harm to others or seek to discredit neighbors, who look with scorn on the vile, but honor those who fear Yehovah, who hold to an oath no matter the cost, who refuse usury when they lend money and refuse a bribe to damage the innocent. Those who do these things never will be moved. How can we learn to love our Creator after reading this fascinating short 15th chapter of Psalm? We can aim to find rest in the tent of Yehovah, aim to live on the holy mountain of Yehovah. Aim to live a blameless life, lining up your thoughts, words, and actions with the Torah of Yehovah. Aim to live uprightly, speaking the truth of Yehovah's written word from your heart. Protect life. Honor one another. Fear Yehovah. Hold to an oath, no matter the cost. Lend money without charging interest. Never take a bribe to damage the innocent. Trust you have all will firmly keep you in place when you do these things. How can we love others as Yeshua loves us? Encourage all to fear Yehovah. Bear one another's burdens. Point all boldly to Yehovah. Produce spiritual fruit, love, joy, peace, patience, kindness, goodness, faithfulness, humility, and self-control. We'll end with the Arianic blessing using the name. Yehovah will kneel before you presenting gifts, and he will guard you with a hedge of protection. Yehovah will illuminate the wholeness of his being toward you, bringing order, and he will provide you with love, sustenance, and friendship. Yehovah will lift up the wholeness of his being and look upon you, set in place all you need to be whole and complete. Shalom, shalom.